Hello, welcome back to KG Simple Reviews. Today I'm going to be reviewing these solar landscape lights. So this is a two pack and something I really like about these is that they are both heat resistant, frost resistant and waterproof. So that's gonna cover all the bases for all year round. I'm gonna go ahead and open these up so I can show you what they look like, some of the fun things about them and how I'm going to be using them. So here is everything that it comes with. I'm gonna go ahead and let these charge up in the sun for a little bit and I will show you my setup. So this is everything that these come with. It comes with same some anchors and screws in case you do wanna fasten these onto a fence post or the side of your house or something, you can do so right here. And also comes with two stakes. I'm going to be using the stakes for these since I'm gonna be putting them outside near a water feature. And when you do use them with stakes, you just push them in right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and put these outside to get them fully charged up in the sun, and then I'll show you how I'm gonna use them. Okay, so you just push this in the ground however far you would like it here, and then you can rotate this light 360 degrees on the stand, and then you can also tilt it all the way straight up and then all the way down, just depending on your preference. So I'm just, I'm probably gonna have to adjust this when it gets a little bit darker, but I would like to face this kind of at the waterfall over there. And I'm just gonna set this one up kind of the same way, just over on the other side. Okay, so I have this turned on. I have this right here next to the water feature and I just have it pointed kind of down to the rocks and then over to the waterfall. And I just feel like that's so pretty. It gives it a little bit of kind of a magical look to it. You can see that I have the other one right over here on the upper left. And I just think it's really pretty having them both rotate through the rainbow colors. So I'm just gonna show you some of the different settings here. When you click the power button, one time that is the first setting where it just rotates through all the different colors nice and slow like that as you can see and i'm just going to go through each of the different settings here one by one this is setting number two and this is just white so i'm just going to point this up to the waterfall a little bit more tilted up just like that and you can see this other one is turned on to that white setting as well I feel like that's a really nice basic setting if you just wanna light up the bottom of a tree or your water feature, I think that's really pretty. Okay, setting number three, this is the red light. Setting four is the green light. Setting five is the blue light. Setting six is kind of a yellow green light. Setting seven is a purple light. This is setting eight, and I think this one's really pretty. It's kind of a light blue, like teal color. Setting nine is kind of a light blue, like a dimmer color. I think this one's actually really pretty. And then when you press it for the 10th time, it turns off. I honestly feel like my favorite setting is the first setting where it just rotates through all the different colors. I think that is so pretty and I just love the vibe that it gives. Something that I really like about these is that they are waterproof. So even if they get rained on, it's not going to affect how they work at all. So these are still going to be able to charge up on cloudier days. They're just not going to be charged up as much. So you definitely want to put these in a place that is going to get the most amount of light just to make sure that they stay nice and charged up. I really like that you can just turn these lights on and leave them on. They're automatically going to turn off when it gets too bright to be able to see them. They're automatically going to turn on again in the evening time. So I just love that you don't have to mess around with them you can just leave them on just like this i'm gonna go ahead and put a link in the description down below so you can go check this out yourself if you found this review useful please give this video a thumbs up and follow us for more thanks for watching bye